Greetings, 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 Osio, Mabriqua, Halito, Sakpase, Watagoan. My people, my people, my people, it's a beautiful day and hope everybody's feeling well. I'm not going to make this video too long, all right? On Thursday, around 6 or 7 p.m., all right, I'm going to be in Stone Mountain, Georgia, at the mound. I will be doing a ritual. I'll be doing an invocation. I'm going to be burning some sage. I'm going to do an honor, okay, a presentment, an honor to the ancestors. All right, I'm traveling all the way from New York just for that purpose by going to Stone Mountain, Georgia. That's the only reason why I'm going. In the event of me going, a few brothers and sisters are actually meeting up with me. Brother Crumb is one of them. And we are all going to participate in presenting this honor to our ancestors. All right. What I'm asking of you now, you don't have to do it for those of you who say that you're about this life and you want things to change. Then this is how you could help. If you cannot make it in person, then please, as of 6 p.m., okay, as of 6 p.m. this evening, once again, as of 6 p.m. this evening until 6 p.m. tomorrow, which is Thursday, if you could do a fasting. Now, fasting doesn't necessarily mean that you have to go hungry or not eat. That's not what it means. All it means is that try to see if you could consume more liquids, all right? More liquids would be great, okay? You could do light salads. That's cool as well. But definitely more liquids as possible, preferably distilled water. If you, if you could do that, that would be great, all right? Um, and once again, I'm not asking people to starve themselves. This is not what I'm saying. You could, you know, you could drink a, a light soup. But if you could sustain yourself from 6 p.m. to 6 p.m., that would be great. For those of you who can do that, then start your fast from 6 a.m. Thursday Thursday sunrise to 6 p.m. Thursday sunset. All right. So you could do it two ways from 6 p.m. this evening, Wednesday to 6 p.m. Thursday. All right. Which is tomorrow. Or you could do 6 a.m. to 6, 6 a.m sunrise on thursday to 6 p.m sunset on thursday all right that may be feasible for a lot of you which is what i would suggest for those of you who are not used to fasting okay another thing is this i'm gonna make an attempt to bring this live on my facebook because youtube is not allowing me to do live at this present moment so for those of you who don't have my facebook it will be in the link below also I'm going to have Crumb do it on his YouTube channel. So either way, there will be access on YouTube and Facebook. You feel me? All right. For those of you who really want to help along again with this, with my journey, I'm going to have my cash app in the link below. Please support. All right. For gas, toll, etc. Just for my travel, um, hotel if need be, um, which I doubt I'll need. All right. But however, I'm just putting that out there. I'm not begging anybody for anything, but if you feel that, hey, listen, you know, Chief Kalanago is making some moves and he's doing some things, and you feel that this is a benefit to us as a people, going to Stone Mountain, evoking some of our ancestors' spirits, honoring them, okay, doing this invocation, then the Cash App is below. By all means, feel free to support. For those of you who are going to donate to that, all right, or just pretty much the work that I'm doing, I give thanks in advance. So thank you. Have a blissful and productive and an uplifting and also an enlightening day. Have a great continuation. All right. Just to reiterate real short. I'm leaving New York, going to Stone Mountain, Georgia. I'm leaving today, but tomorrow I'm going to do an invocation at Stone Mountain for the ancestors of presentment. All right. A few people are meeting me there, but if you can't, please. By all means, you, you are able to participate via, you know, a live that we're going to do. So we all could do this all over the world and all over the country. It's imperative that we start evoking our ancestors and bringing more of a spiritual aspect to this genocide and the war that we are dealing with. We have to call on to our spiritual parents. So once again, the GoFundMe is in the link below if you feel like you want to support my journey. 
I would appreciate that. Wado, thank you.